Okay, so I'm running out of time here. I got to create these nukes for my uh, queen cells. And uh, I'm trying to take some oh boy, pressure off of this hive here. But uh, in order to create that nuke, I'm going to have to uh, shake these bees down over a queen excluder and split it out. No choice. Okay. Rather than looking for the queen, rather than looking for the queen, I'm just going to shake these bees down. You know, it's really funny. This 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 colony just doesn't want to draw this comb. Little by little, they're drawing it, but not very much, which is surprising for such a robust colony. Oh boy, what did I do? Okay. I'm just gonna set it out there. Uh oh. This has got queen cups on it. Nothing in them though, which is good. I need another box. Okay. That one. And that one. Put that there, put that there. Oh. I should give it a little scan. For the queen, but I doubt I'll find it. Whoa. Pollen frame with cap brood and shit tons of queen cups. Well, they're really starting to polish them down there. So, this is a good idea to get these this colony uh, Haven't seen the queen yet. All cap brood there, cap brood there. Lots of drones. Don't see any queen cells, that's good. No queen cells, no queen cells, good. Golly, I just keep hitting that damn box. 
So you're asking why I'm shaking them down. What I'm gonna do, and I've got all this brood, I'm shaking them down because I don't wanna look for the queen. So I'm shaking them down to get all the bees in the bottom box. Then I'll put a queen excluder down and the bees will come up. The nurse bees will come around the brood. This is just nectar frame here. And then I'll just take my splits off of the top box and it will be 100% queenless, or it should be anyways. Okay, good deal. Okay, that's that, that's that. Take the box. Top. And there the nurse bees can climb back in. Alright. And that won't take long at all for them to uh, move up over that brood. And tomorrow I'll pull it off and create uh, my nukes. Now I I should have done this yesterday, uh, however, it was raining and it's raining today. That's why the bees are very, very, very defensive today. And this was just not a good idea, but I had to do what I had to do. Um, got stung a couple of times, looks like. This is a, uh, a colony that has had an issue with chalk brood, so requeening it's probably a good idea. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, Oh jeez. Do the same thing. Okay. <sighs> Breeze? No. Leave it alone. Trust me, leave it alone. Okie dokie. Now in a perfect world, I'd go through all these and I'd look for brood frames and make sure that there's enough brood frames down below. But right now, I have absolutely no choice in the matter.
Whew. Now that's a nice frame of brood. This colony, that, that is great. This colony had all chalk brood. It rebounded really well. I'm actually kind of shocked. Really well. Really quite shocked. There's a nice nuke frame for sure. This one's got, okay, good. Making sure there's no queen cells, which there are none, good. Another nice cat brood frame. As long as it doesn't have chalk brood, I'm pretty happy with it actually. I'm going, come on. There's a queen cell here, queen cup. Let's see here. And this one is full of royal jelly. So, I know they were gonna supersede this queen before. That was a swarm cell. I just wasn't sure whether the supersedures took or not. There's another. Uh, that's a queen cup, nothing in it though. Queen cup, queen cup, no eggs. No eggs, no eggs, good. All right. This is just a nectar frame. Whoa, oh boy, that's a big pollen frame. all the adult bees look at this frame now that is a frame of pollen holy smoke I should probably just hold that steady there so you can see it okay I don't think I'm gonna give that up that's gonna be a pollen frame I'm gonna take for my graphs when I regraft Okay. So I think I got enough for what, what I need for my nukes right now. Um, I got four frames of brood in that one and I got about seven to eight in that one. So uh, that'll get me, that'll get me my, uh, that'll get me all my mating nukes that I'm gonna need. Um, like I said, usually I would do this in the after, early afternoon and then I'd peel this off, make my nukes later in the afternoon, four hours later or something. Uh, but I'm gonna have to wait till tomorrow and I'll peel this off 
put them in um, two frame mating nukes and uh, give them each a cell and take them out to the farm and you know let nature take its course.